Yeah, so the second thing about um, uh, increasing your speed is uh, uh, fast is good, but it's not just being fast, it's not good enough, you know. So to sound more confident and more convincing, I think you also need to take care about the tone, the quality of sound, the dynamic uh, on the accented note, which give more expression to your scale. So for example, if I just play this phrase, same speed, it's still fast but it sounds boring. So if you add the accent the note, which you should know and analyze, it sounds more convincing and more uh, expression, it's more attractive. So. Is the key is about finding the accented note and also you don't have to play every note at the same length I mean you don't need to let it ring everything the same then it's like you speak without any expression if you know which note to not stuck at all but maybe cut it a little shorter to give more attention to the next one for example the first note uh, it's not in the on the beat. I would play it softer and also shorter because I want to get attention to the second one, which is on the beat. It sounds more attacky, and it's more like like you know what you are saying. Also important if you can analyze the phrase or the scale of the starting point and the arrival. Uh, it's like if you're going on a fast motorbike and if you know that to the edges that you have to, to take a break. So it's always more cool if you like go full power and stop exactly where you want to stop. You need to see already the arrival point. So for example, I want to go from here to here's my last note. I need to build a phrase. So I'm very clear of where I want to arrive. So don't just go and then go along with the way you have to see your destination. Then the journey will be uh, clearer, will be more uh, confident.